Pisces, we're going to look at what this person wants you to know. Okay, so we're going to tap into the energies of someone significant around you that wants you to know something. Okay, um, that wants to share how they're feeling um, and perhaps they haven't had the word. So we're going to connect into their energies um, to share a little bit of what's happening under the covers there. Okay. So let's get started for Pisces. Can you please share what the person that's on their mind and what they're thinking about Pisces? What do they want Pisces to know, please? Dear Spirit, thank you. What do they want Pisces to know? get started we've got the chariot the high priestess and the seven of pentacles okay thank you wow pisces wow this is pretty cool okay Straight up, what I'm getting with the energies is that this person does want to take action and does want to move forward. I feel um, wherever they're at right now, it's kind of like it's something I haven't noticed truly on this card before. But with this, the chariot, I feel here they're. You know how we each have, a, you know, our light, beautiful side and then we have our shadow self, right? I feel that they're potentially working through something right now um, and hence why they probably haven't truly moved forward towards you. Um, but I think in your own way, whether they're trying to connect with you telepathy-wise, like they're thinking about you, that you're – on their mind um but i think there's a part of you that knows some truth around this where i don't think you're too worried about it pisces but i think it's on your mind um and i feel some way perhaps you you are communicating whether you're having dreams whether you're just getting thoughts about them and in deep thought um it's probably because too they're they're also thinking about you so any messages that you may receive or intuition please trust in that okay that's um what spirit wants to let you know they are doing the work whatever it is they want to let you know they are doing the work because they have been hurt Pisces they have been let down in the past um, so whatever path or whatever journey that you and this person are potentially connecting in and going on they're just they've been hurt they've kind of been you know I feel in some way that they've been abandoned um, and they're, they're working through this um, you know their stability too it's kind of like they're in a rebuild phase of for themselves um so that's a little bit of part of perhaps why they're taking it slow they're still healing a little bit but they're doing the work okay they really are doing the work to build this sense of um planting the seeds effectively right they're, they're rebuilding i mean if this is a person that's gone through divorce a major separation um a business breakup whatever it is it's taken a toll on them okay they're in a good place but they've still got some work that they want to do within themselves they're still rebuilding their own um sense of security for and stability and that's important to them before they kind of show up and say g'day i'm here kind of thing um so if it's going slow if it is not progressing as you're expecting that could you know could be why but there's definitely an offer coming in so you've got the page of swords and the page of cups so potentially while you're waiting for this person someone else comes on through but it could be too that that person comes on through with a with some form of information that gives you that little bit of clarity um and then eventually gives you a a sign of I want to make this work. So I feel you're going to have communication from this person. If you, if it's been a little quiet, there's communication that's going to be coming through. And I think they're going to tell you how they feel Pisces. Okay. 
Um, it's just not going to be all this big grand thing. They want to take it slow. They want to, you know, take it easy and steady kind of thing. So let's um, get some clarity for you. Spirit, can you please clarify with the chariot? And we got two. So you got the world and the ten of voices. And like I said, I think they're, they're healing. Um, and the ten of voices, they're doing okay, but they're still kind of rising out of the ashes a bit, Pisces, all right? So, you know, just be a little bit gentle on them. But they're they're ready to to lean in. You know, they could also be moving house. They could also be moving jobs. There's some form of movement that they're potentially taking, um, and they're doing things a little bit differently. Um, so, if I can hear my kitty cat, she's she wants to come in the call, so she's saying hello. Um, yeah, so the, the with the world card, the ten of voices and the chariot, I think for them, you know, if they are traveling a lot, I think they're kind of soul searching in their own way. I think they're excited that they have met you, Pisces, but they're not in a rush, okay? They're currently in – they're just working on themselves right now. And if there is any ac action taking, um, I do think that – potentially they're they're moving um whether they're moving house they're moving jobs they're doing something because for them this is a new beginning as well with the ten of um the ten of swords with the high priestess and the seven of emotions um there's a lot on this person's mind and you've probably connected into that i mean if you're trying to connect into their energy you might ha be feeling like like what is going on in this person's head? Like they've got a lot, lot going on um, is kind of what I'm getting from the seven of emotions. I think they're really trying to connect to their, their heart and their choices and their decisions. Again, they want to make the right, the right choices, the right steps forward. They're, they're planting the seeds. They're doing the work. Like this is a new beginning for them too. But I think if you're connecting to their energy or their thoughts because this I mean with high priestess this is about information that is being received okay um, downloaded um, tap, tapping into your intuition having foresight understanding kind of thing and I think you're going to notice if you're connecting in with them this is why it's kind of like what is going on because I think they've just got so much that they're trying to do right now to fill their cup. Um, so they've, they've kind of put to keep themselves busy through their own transformation. I feel like they've put a lot in their path and hence why there's things that are taking um, their time. I think they're quite distracted right now trying to fill their own cup um, and, and build, like I've said before. Um, that's kind of what I'm getting. So I'm interested to know if like you're connecting in with this person energetically or whenever you speak to them it's just like some stuff's just not making sense I don't think this is another person Pisces like that they're around I think they're just trying to figure out what like they're doing so they might be a bit scattered right now okay and as I said if you're connecting into that their energy you're probably feeling that too it's like a lot of busyness in the mind a lot of looping thoughts it's interesting really interesting um, so you've got the two of emotions and the seven of pentacles. So for them right now, they are, they, they're making, they are making a decision. They are looking at what, you know, to, to try and balance things out. They're really trying. I do feel they're trying to build a solid foundation for themselves because whatever they've been through Pisces, like this hasn't been easy for them either. I'm not saying that they're in a bad place at all. I just feel like they're just really trying to find their joy on their own which is i think a wonderful part of the healing journey Clover, get down honey oopsie okay so let's have a look at the five of pentacles please thought they wanted to come out yeah so you've got the sun card and the five of emotions so i mean they've got the five of pentacles and the five of emotions so that's a double confirmation that they've been left out like someone's really hurt them someone's I feel abandoned them has kind of taken a lot of their sense of worth sense of security sense of foundation so this person is in rebuild mode Pisces okay and then um you've got the sun card so 
they're definitely moving through it. This is where they're planning to get here. They're, and if they're not, that's where they're, they're moving towards. They're like looking for that sunlight, looking for that ray and rays of light and that freshness. And that's probably who they are within. And they're trying to reclaim that, you know. So page of swords, we've got the two of materials and the four of materials. So we've got the two of materials again. Um, did we have the two of materials here? No, we didn't. We had the two of emotions. Um, so... For them, it is really about balancing things out and building their security. They really want to make sure that they have a solid foundation and maybe they're, that's a bit of their worry right now and what's slowing them down because they don't want to lose the things that they've created and they've done because they've built, built that. So if they're not as open and are not as sharing as much as they may be, it's because they've been – um, trying to figure, figure that part out for them. Um, and making sure like someone's not taking advantage of them is kind of what I feel here. So if you're finding that the, the energy just doesn't like, you can't figure them out. I think they're going to open up to you about why that is. And I think it's important Pisces. Don't be afraid to ask questions to get the clarity you need. Sure. Is there a way to present that and a way to, um, express that you acknowledge these things and I think that's going to be pretty surprising for them as like wow this person actually does see me this person actually recognizes who I am and what I've been through and they're not afraid of it or afraid of me you know um and like I said I do feel that they're gonna give you some clarity and then an, an offer Let, let's have a look please spirit can you please share You've got the page of voices again and the page of cups. So you've got the page again. Can you please help clarify? Thank you. Let's get one more, please, Spirit, to help us clarify what this is. Thank you. Okay, so you've got the page of voices, the knight of materials, and the four of inspiration. This person could have children, Pisces, okay? Um, and that's another reason why they're being cautious, what, why it's important for them to build a strong and solid foundation. Um, I think as well, like, whatever that is, they're going to – they're definitely – I feel coming in with, with an offer, um, you know, perhaps they could be someone who is well off, but for them, because they've lost a lot of it through whatever separation that they've gone through. Um, again, this could be business separation. This could be love. Um, but whatever it is, I feel they potentially had, were married before or they have kids um, but I think you're going to learn a lot about this person. They're going to start sharing more about themselves and really open up. And I feel the offer goes from a page of cups to a knight of materials. So I feel like you're going to get, they're going to show their hand a bit Pisces and open their heart a little, but then they're going to come through with a solid, stronger offer. Um, one that's more stable. And I think you're going to get that news. Okay. Um, I do think they're seeking this, but I think that there's this part of them too, like, they're not in a rush is what I'm getting. Okay. But you are going to get the clarity that you need. That's coming towards you. I think they had a family. Okay. Before they have kids. Um, and that's probably again, why they're in rebuild phase, but I feel this person is in a good place and that could be another part of them being busy. They're moving homes with their, maybe with their kids, you know, they're kind of, maybe they're doing some travel right now. There's a lot of movement for this person, but you excite them, Pisces. They, they're paying attention to you. They're just trying to figure out how do I balance out creating a new life for myself, creating the stability for my kids, um, but also, you know, doing the things that keep me whole and happy is kind of what I'm getting here, okay? So let's have a look at um, a final message from Spirit that, that you can share with Pisces, please. Final message for, from Spirit. Or Pisces, please, regarding this situation. Thank you. 
Ooh. Your commitment is being tested. Wow. So that could be part of it, Pisces. They don't want anything too pushy, too controlling. They just want to be them. So that's kind of what I'm getting from that card about the commitment is being tested. I think it is, is like whether you're going to be patient and supportive of what they've got going on too. I know um, it's an important time, you know, to get that clarity, to get that commitment. I think it's okay to ask those questions, Pisces. You're allowed to ask the questions that you need to gain that clarity and to, to feel clear on where you're going. But remember, you are the prize, okay, in this situation. You are the prize. This might be a wonderful person who's come in your life, but remember you are the prize too, okay? And they're lucky to have you and all those things. But when it comes to commitment is being tested, don't try and be someone that you're not for, for this potential person or relationship. I think what is important is if you do enjoy this person, you know, I, I think sometimes too, Pisces, we need to be connected. We need to be close. That's how we roll, you know, but can you still have those things and be those things without, um, putting on pressure to get what you need figure out how you can best support this person. And I think that's part of the, the commitment being tested. Okay. Is that they're just not a hundred percent there yet because they're trying to figure out how do I do this? How do I make this work? This is new for me. I've just been focused like kind of on my own things on rebuilding my kids, if they have kids. Um, and yeah, they're just trying to figure that out right now. So that's probably where the commitment is being tested is whether you really are up for, this dynamic or type of relationship for where it is now, um, for allow allowing it to grow and blossom into what it is that you are seeking and also what they are seeking. Right. So I'm going to leave that with you, Pisces stay well and put, yeah, let me know in the comments below if this resonated for you. Um, and yeah, if you feel connected, I invite you to like, and subscribe, I'll catch you later.